In the Polish language, the at symbol which appears in every email address is called MMK. Many Polish people wonder why is it called so, but actually doesn't this symbol look a bit like this monkey? I think it looks exactly like a long-tailed monkey sitting in its natural position with its tail wrapped around its body. However, not every nation associates this symbol with a monkey. In many languages, just like in English, this symbol is described with the preposition at. In Austria, this sign is called an alpha in a circle. In Indonesia, it's an A in a circumference. In Vietnam, it's called a hook-shaped A. And in Bosnia and Serbia, a crazy A. In many countries, an at symbol is associated with some animal qualities. For example, in Georgia, it's called an A with a tail, and in Denmark, Norway and Sweden, an A with an elephant's trunk. In Indonesia, they also call it a snail A, a monkey A or a turtle A. In Sweden, it's also called an elephant's ear or a cat's foot. In Denmark and Norway, it's got a name pig's tail. In Finland, cat's tail or simply meow meow. Polish people living in the USA happen to call it a kitten. The name monkey's tail is used in Switzerland, Netherlands, Germany, Luxembourg, Romania and South African Republic. In France, Italy and Belarus it's called a snail and in Korea they use the name of a sea snail which is a local snack. In Russia, Uzbekistan and Kyrgyzstan it's a dog or a doggy, and in Armenia, a puppy. Hungarians call it a worm or a larva. Chinese people use the name little mouse. Greeks call it a duckling. There are also nations with choose names of dishes. Norwegians, for instance, call it a twisted twirl. In Hebrew, it's a strudel. In Hungarian, a twist or a croissant. Czechs and Slovakians call the at symbol with their name for wrapped marinated herring. There are also other ideas. In Kazakhstan it's called an ear of the moon or dog's head. In Ukraine it's a snail, an ear or a doggy. But let's come back to those who consequently call it a monkey. Apart from the Polish people, there are also Slovenians, Macedonians, Croatians and Germans. In fact, Germans have gone farther and they use a name of a specific species of monkeys, Atelini, also known as spider monkeys. So, what do you think? Which name is the most appropriate name for the internet at symbol? Doesn't this monkey look exactly like it? This is a very small South American monkey called a squirrel monkey. However, all long-tailed monkeys rest and sleep in a similar hunched position wrapped in their tails.